Hello, everybody. Blessings in the name of the Lord. Send you a strong hug for all you people that have been in training of spiritual warfare. If you want to learn more about how to release someone, how you can get the knowledge about things, about things that happen for people being attacked for witchcraft, here your pastor Pedro Carrillo, pastor of Bethesda community in Barranquilla, Colombia. We have a follower, a lady sent us a question. She wants to keep her name confidential. She asked me that feels itching in her body and she feels desperate and anxious or distressed. She wants for you, uh, she wants to know what does it mean, this kind of things. Well, let's pray. God, thank you for everything. Give us the wisdom and all we need through your Holy Spirit so people can understand. Um, Lord, we receive revelation from your Holy Spirit. Well, my friends, uh, on the witchcraft and sorcery, uh, people use some elements um, to, for, for the people to feel desperate. Uh, we can tell that like torment or torture, uh, there are some elements like spicy pe pepper, the pepper that everybody knows uh, to use in, you know, to cook. And there is conjure, conjure pepper. Uh, they put that on a doll, uh, on a picture. Sometimes they throw it uh, to your home, to your home's door. So the person feels to move. A uh, person feels the itching on all the body, sometimes feels as well on her or his waist. The person scratches constantly, sometimes on the back or on the skin. The person feels to scratch. Um, him or herself all the time. Sometimes the itching increases during the evening hours, approximately around five, six o'clock in the afternoon or in the evening, when, they is, uh, when the day is getting dark. So when the person goes into her or his bed, feels like the bed is dust. That because someone has thrown out pepper, um, I told you, could be on your home's door or in a pedestal or altar. Also, the person being affected could dream that they are flying over roofs or trees. Sometimes keeps, the person keeps dreaming that is flying in several locations. Person feels desperate, willing to walk or run away. When she or he is at home, if they throw pepper when they when the person arrives to her or his home, then they feel desperate and they and when they are out of home, they don't feel it. They don't feel absolutely nothing. They feel calm and quiet because they cannot because uh, they are not near to the place where the pepper is. They also use these elements on business related. Uh, they throw pepper on business entrance. So when people go to buy stuff, they also feel desperate. Besides, um, and that feeling uh, to run away so the owner of the business doesn't make any sale and the clients or customers feel to run away, to go out of the, the store. Uh, they don't feel comfortable to stay inside um, that store or business or, or a place who sell stuff, whatever supermarket, whatever your business is. Um, pepper is the one that makes the feel people uh, uncomfortable because pepper doesn't allow for the person to feel comfortable. So clients goes away from that store or whatever business and they don't buy it at all. When they do this to a specific person in her, in her or his home, 
is cost because they they want to make the person sell his or her home so they move um, also when that happens it's probably a neighbor that doesn't want you to be nearby they don't want you to be your neighbor or a person uh, interested to buy that property and you don't want uh, then you don't want to sell it so uh, they do that in order for you to sell the property so you're gonna feel uncomfortable and they make and they take advantage of that feeling of desperate so at the end you sell the property uh, or offer even less of the value of the property so the person affected sometimes offers that that house even cheaper besides uh, the pepper they use some other elements for example the mercury uh, this is the liquid metal actually for you have to have an idea what it is that comes into the thermometer there is a little bowl inside that thermometer that lifts uh, as the same as the same time uh, the temperature is getting higher so that bowl is made by mercury also that uses in the minecraft to get that gold uh, the mercury is also uses as the pepper to throw that to throw that out into homes or business and that also makes you feel to scratch yourself all the time in your skin also they use gunpowder to produce this kind of feeling desperate anxious anxiousness and all that also they use it to make you feel um, touchy or ir irritable in a bad mood and being always with a bad mood always being fighting with everybody or yelling and they use that to destroy marriages too which is they place to give you an idea which is they place two dolls representing the couple and they put pepper in the middle of the dolls so they have a uh, for example if they have a conversation always finish with a huge fight or they uh, as well they spread it out over the dolls of the couple so they um, they want to separate this couple they this this couple wake wake up in a bad mood they feel um, they don't feel comfortable when they are together they feel like um, that feeling of rejection and always being discussing all the time if you feel to scratch yourself and think this is your case you could be under a work of uh, witchcraft so my friends this is the answer of the lady who sent us the, the question Lord says in the Bible, you know the truth, and the truth will make you feel free. It's going to make you actually completely free. As long as you get clear on this, Lord will give the light and makes you understand uh, too many things. Also, they place pepper in the vagina. Um, they make a doll, they open her legs, they make a hole between her legs and they put a pepper on it. So the woman feels to scratch herself in the vagina and look for men to prostitute. Sometimes they place pepper on the anus of a man so they turn into an homosexual and look for a man and look for men if you feel this uh, if you feel this on the anus so you know what what does it mean if you think uh, you are with these symptoms uh, so let's pray so God um, so God is gonna make you feel uh, it's gonna make you actually get all, all um, it's gonna make you f completely free so here not only we make an explanation of how things happen we also pray to give that freedom you need so all the works that witches make jesus the lord can break that down and give you the freedom so let's pray raise your hands god in the name of jesus lord i pray i praise you i lift them 
I praise you. Thank you to make me understand or explain me what's going on. We request the presence of your Holy Spirit and we want the fire of your Holy Spirit. Please come down over our lives and we stand up and declare war against any altar or pedestal. I declare war against any altar creates under my name and all the pepper is spread out over my body my home, my business, um, come on, you need to say it, you need to, uh, to say these things, pepper, mercury, gunpowder has been thrown in my business, in my office, my job, over my body, uh, over my marriage, to destroy it, all that pepper, I I send the order to be born. Please, you need to say it, you need to express yourself. You need to open your mouth. All that pepper is now without power in the in the spirit, in the spiritual world, and it burn it. And I leave it without any power in the name of Jesus. I unauthorize this in my life, in the name of Jesus, uh, all gunpowder is born and is unauthorized in the name of Jesus. And I leave it without power, uh, power in the spiritual world. All praying that have been thrown to my life, words, praise, sorceries, Lord, to make me feel like in a bad mood, all these, I leave them without any power to make me feel desperate in order for me to move, to sell my home, do not make sales in my business. All those prayers are unauthorized, leave them, and I leave them without any power. Um, praise to make people prostitute to make them homosexual. All those elements are now born in the name of Jesus. Born the pepper in the vagina, in the anus. I burn it and live without any power. And now in the name of Jesus, all the spirit of desperate anxiousness, those are tied in the name of Jesus. And I send the order to release and go out of that body, of my body. Desperate feeling, anxiousness. Now take, please take a deep breath and exhale. You need to do this exercise to take a breath and exhale for about five minutes and say, desperation goes out. All the itching goes out. Take a breath again and exhale. If a headache comes, don't worry about it. Don't worry, it should come yawns, burps, vomits, uh, tremors in your, in the, in your body, uh, shavers. A lot of things can come, but no worries. Just keep breathing and exhale and say, live. My, leave me itching on my body. Leave me now. It is possible that now we are praying that itching increases, but no worries. That always happens. But you are going to be free, in the name of Jesus. Just simple follow, follow the instructions I'm telling you. Uh, take a deep breath and exhale. Well, Thank you for everybody that um, that made this um, pray. Please write down a comment with your testimony. Please subscribe into this channel so you can receive all the videos we record. And please click on the like um, and share it with somebody else uh, so they can listen and if they have this kind of problem they can be free as well so we bless your business we bless your marriage and goodbye